Hi, is competitive programming really required to go and crack all the dream companies like Google, Amazon, Microsoft, etc.? Not really. So competitive programming, yes, it's very important, of course. You get to learn so much. You are able to solve a lot of questions in a go, right? So you're able to make logic very quickly. But yes, of course, if you say that you're scared of competitive programming and you're not able to do any question in a particular time frame, the important stuff for you to do before that is in order to apply to a company and crack the companies, uh, so basically crack all the coding rounds as well, what you need to do is practice coding. So in competitive programming, of course, there is time bound. But when you go for the questions which have already come in Google, Facebook, Microsoft, etc., you, what you will see is the question, the level of questions are a bit um, lower than the ones in competitive programming. So what you need to do is you need to practice all the questions which have come in Google, Microsoft, etc. before right uh, in early years so you have to complete that you need to make sure that you have done all of those and then you sit in the current exams so in the current coding rounds also what you need to do is you need to make sure that your project your project should be well what i mean by that is for example if you're doing android make sure the app is live on play store if you're doing a project in web development then make sure that a uh, website is live if you're doing a project in let's say ML or AI, then what you need to do is you need to make sure that your project is on GitHub and you know, you it is working, the code is uh, working well. Also, you need to make sure that you are good in data structures and algorithms. That is also very important. So if you have all of this and you do the practice on Lead Code or Geeks for Geeks or Code Studio, right? So, you know, don't lose hope just don't lose hope. So you'll be able to crack the coding round and then after that, the interviews as well. And along with those projects, your resume for sure should get shortlisted. Great. All the best. Thank you so much.